heat detection has been described as one of the dark arts, part science, part understanding animal behaviour, and part careful attention to detail. But it's our job to maximise the science and minimise the luck to make sure the cows are inseminated on time, every time. Today, we're visiting a farm in the Haraki Plains that's adopted all of the basics and have achieved great reproductive results. So, Ash and Tegan, tell us about the reproductive performance on your farm. So last season we achieved an 80% six-week and calf rate with a 6% empty rate, and that is on an 11-week mating period. Uh, and we're really happy with that. So how important is good heat detection to achieve that result? In our system of being 11 weeks mating with all AI, heat detection is absolutely crucial because we don't have any bulls to pick up the slack. So Tegan, what are the main things that you did? So about five weeks before our plan starter mating, we do a tail paint. Um, then come our plan starter mating, we'll make sure that tail paint's touched up again. Um, really strong emphasis on observing our cows. We purposely select an evening AI run for the first six weeks. It gives us plenty of time during our day to observe the cows and watch what's happening. Um, we also put a lot of labour into our heat detection and just really strong emphasis on teamwork. Um, together, all eyes, we pick up more than what we would by ourselves. So. That's great. And how important is it to involve the whole team? It's really important. We pull the team together twice a year to do a training, just to make sure we're all on the same page. So the big thing to note is that the signs of heat only last for a day, and then bam, she's ovulating before you know it. So we're going to be really quick off the mark, and that's why heat detection is just so important. So we need to understand the signs of heat. First, is the cow kind of sniffing and, and you know, in that group of other cows that are on heat? Is she mounting other cows? But most importantly, is she standing? Because it's when a cow's standing that you know she actually really is on heat. And that's why the tail paint's so important as well, because the tail paint, paint is our sign that that cow has been rubbed and she's on that standing heat. So that covers about 80% of the cows, but it's the other 20% that are trickier. And these are often the cows costing you big time. The key is to apply tail paint early, aiming for five weeks before mating starts. And ideally, we want to use heat detection patches as well. And that way we can use a combination of the behaviour stuff we've learnt today, plus those visual aids, to make sure we're getting every single cow that's on heat. By focusing on accurate heat detection, you can achieve high in calf rates. And it's the same old story. The more cows pregnant early, the more milk, and the better the returns. Job done. Watch all our videos by downloading the NZ Farmer Tips app for Apple or Android today.